Dividend investing is a popular investment strategy that involves investing in companies that pay dividends, which are regular payments made by a company to its shareholders. Dividends are typically paid out of a company's profits, and they can be an excellent source of passive income for investors. In fact, many investors use dividend investing as a way to generate income during their retirement years. So, how do you get started with dividend investing? Here are a few tips. Choose the right companies to invest in. When it comes to dividend investing, it's essential to choose companies that have a history of paying dividends consistently. Look for companies that have a track record of paying increasing dividends over time. It's also important to research the financials of the company to ensure that they have the ability to continue paying dividends in the future. One way to evaluate a company's dividend paying history is to look at its dividend growth rate. This rate measures the percentage increase in dividends paid by the company over a specific period. Typically, a company with a high dividend growth rate is a good choice for dividend investing. Another factor to consider when choosing companies for dividend investing is their payout ratio. This ratio measures the percentage of a company's earnings that it pays out in dividends. A company with a low payout ratio may have more room to increase its dividends in the future, while a company with a high payout ratio may have less flexibility to do so. Consider the dividend yield. The dividend yield is another essential metric to consider when choosing companies for dividend investing. This metric measures the annual dividend payment divided by the current stock price, expressed as a percentage. A higher dividend yield can be attractive to investors, but it's important to remember that a high yield could also be a red flag. When evaluating a company's dividend yield, it's important to also consider its price-to-earnings ratio. This ratio measures the company's current stock price divided by its earnings per share. A high P-E ratio may indicate that the stock is overvalued, which could negatively impact its future dividend payments. Reinvest your dividends. When you receive dividend payments, you have the option to reinvest them back into the company by purchasing more shares. This can help you compound your returns over time, which can lead to significant wealth growth. Many brokerage firms offer dividend reinvestment programs, which automatically reinvest your dividends into additional shares of the same company. Drips can help you avoid transaction fees and take advantage of compounding returns without having to manually reinvest your dividends. Diversify your portfolio. Just like with any investment strategy, it's important to diversify your portfolio. Invest in companies across different sectors and industries to minimize risk. This approach can help you avoid concentration risk, which is the risk of having too much exposure to a single company or sector. One way to diversify your portfolio is to invest in dividend-paying exchange-traded funds or mutual funds. These funds invest in a portfolio of dividend-paying stocks across different industries and sectors, which can help you minimize risk and maximize your returns. In conclusion, dividend investing can be a great way to generate passive income and grow your wealth over time. By choosing the right companies, considering the dividend yield, reinvesting your dividends, and diversifying your portfolio, you can set yourself up for success in dividend investing. Whether you're just starting out or you're a seasoned investor, dividend investing can be a valuable addition to your investment portfolio.